welcome back to my channel so today i am going to do a candle haul video because you know i had to pick up some more candles because i got like completely out and i don't like when i get completely out because usually i have candles on deck and this time i did so i'll be good for a while this time so just stay tuned my candles came from the same company as that one the first one um came from groups creek and i already did a haul video with them so you go ahead and watch it it was mostly lotions i got they do got good candles i've had their candles before and they have good wax melts as well the candles that i got this time was the awaken and it has con coconut and sandalwood i'm about to say cottonwood you know even though that is a tree there is a kind of tree but we're not gonna get into all that that's not important this is not a dendrology class but this is the coconut and sandalwood it has coconut blossom and lemon zest Oops and yeah now i noticed about um goose creek candles their candles are usually pretty close to what they say they are but with their lotions i'm noticing just because it the name of the candle and the scent notes i mean the name of the lotions and the scent notes just don't match to me when it comes to their lotions but their candles are pretty on point amazing candles and this is a three-week candle i've already started burning it i've been keeping it in my bedroom it smells really good i smell everything in it what I like about it is the sandalwood is not too loud. It's very mellowed out because of the um the coconut and the lemon zest. It, it it's a good balance between everything. So with this candle, to me, if you into fall scents and want something you like those sweet kind of sweet almost cakey type fall scents, and you're or you're either you are more of a summer type of girl where you like your lemons and your zestiness and a little bit of coconut, you know, kind of on a tropical spectrum when it comes to your scents. I think this would be good either or because yeah it has the sweetness and it has the not so sweet if you get what I'm saying so yeah this is it three wicks came from Goose Creek I highly recommend this one because it smells great and the smell is really loud in a great way all right so the next group of candles that I have come from a company called so Mississippi, so Mississippi candle company and they make some soy wax candles. This one that I have right here is a spice honey and a tonka. Um, I don't quite have the scent notes, but I'll make sure that I post a link to each candle that I bought so that you can go directly to it and get it for yourself and make purchase for yourself. I love this one because drop the chocolate, but this is an amazing fall scent because it's not too I like fall scents, but some of them it's like they just throw cinnamon on every fall scent, and I don't like that, and this one is not like that. It smells so good. I smell the honey and the tonka. Like, y'all, it merges together so great. I usually burn this one. So far, I've been burning this one in my bathroom. Y'all, it smells so good. And it goes with my decor. So, yes, I would suggest this one. It is a one-week candle. I should see, I've been burning it a lot. And um, I would suggest them. So far, out of all the ones I got, I think this one is probably my top one that I'm probably going to keep in rotation because, listen, it smells so good. It smells so, so good. I can't even describe how good it smells, but that just my nose tries to fit. What I have is a white sage and lavender. I like this one too. I've been burning this one like in my kitchen, dining room, living room area. And it smells exactly what it says. It's the sage and the lavender. It smells amazing, y'all. It's I put it like near my living room because that's the main area I relax in, especially like during the day. And this is a very relaxing scent and it's it lingers for a long time even after I blow the candle out. So I would suggest this one as well if you want a nice relaxing scent. Also, I've used this one uh, when I take a bubble bath with my lights down low and everything, the music going, y'all. Very, very relaxing. The lavender is very strong in here. And the sage smell is too, but they come together perfectly. It's, it's, if you want a relaxing scent, I would say this one, but if you want that warm, cozy, comforting scent, I would definitely go with the spice honey and the taco. Right, this is that Magnolia Bell. I really wish I would have kept up with the scent notes, um, but I'll post them in the comments and everything. This one smells really good too. Very floral scent. Um, think about Magnolia flower blooming. It has a very, um, even like the website says, a high end smell. This is something that you would smell in a high end spa or either a high end boutique. It does smell very luxury. Floral. It has a very classy smell to me. I like it. I can't, when I burn this, I'm gonna let y'all know because I can tell this smell is gonna be very exciting. I think I'm gonna burn this one in my bedroom because it definitely goes with my room. I was really excited about this one and this is the fresh linen because I love the smell of fresh linen. And let me let y'all see. 
It smells exactly like what it says fresh linen. It smells so perfect. Like this is how I want my laundry room to smell all the time. It smells, it smells so clean. It smells extremely clean. It almost smells like cleaning products and laundry detergent type stuff, but it um it has like a soft cotton feel, but you can still smell that fresh laundry detergent type smell, but in a really good subtle way. So I'm definitely gonna be excited to burn this one too because I just love the fresh linen smell. I'm sorry I wish I would have burned this one first, but I'll wait till the other ones are good before I burn out. Alright, so I love cranberries. This is the cranberry woods. I like the smell of this. I smell all the cranberry. I don't really smell much of a woodsy type smell. Not really. This is straight up, smell like straight up cranberry. But it's, this is gonna be, I'm gonna, when the holidays come around, I'm gonna get another one. Because this is a good holiday smell. Well, you, I, I burn this smell year round because I love cranberry. But the holidays, y'all, this would be a good smell for the holidays. This with that Tonka, Tony Tonka, girl, listen. I'm excited about my new candles, y'all. But so far, um, like I said, I've been doing the white sage and lavender, and I did the spice honey and Tonka, and I also been burning my uh Goose Creek candle, y'all. It's been a whole little thing in here, smelling really good, and even after you burn them out, the smell lingers for a while. That was it. Um, if you have any other candle companies you want me to try, drop them down below. Or if you have a candle company yourself, just inbox it to me on one of my Instagram pages. Or, and just let me know and I can possibly, um, I don't mind that. It's important and, you know, promoting, letting people know if it smells good or if I like it or not. So just hit me up on Instagram or either down in the comments, tell me, hey, check out my Instagram. I have a candle company. You know, just let me know. And I also like room sprays as well. I don't mind ordering those. I ordered a room spray from uh, this creek called Forest. It smells really good. The smell lasts a long time. Cause I sprayed it when I left for work and I came back and I still was smelling it some. So that's really, really, really good. And I ordered some more from another company called Ash, I believe. They haven't came yet. So but when I do home, I'll let y'all know. Um, thanks for watching. So like y'all saw bye. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and tap the notification bell so you can know when me, yogurt, I'm last in the video. And um, yeah, I'm gonna holler at y'all later.